Last week on the Rebel Gaming Club, there were gallstones, unicorns, and a budding romance in a car. Ooh! Dan got lucky and walked away with a rare case, while Yesse was stuck in an office like a bitch. But really, that's not why we're here, because it's time to talk about this week. This is the week that everyone has been waiting for. This is the week where the big shit happens. That's right, folks. The Karki Crate. It's in. The Karki Crate is in, and now we have the question, what's in the box, man? What's in the fucking box? Red Bull Gaming Club. Red Bull Gaming Club. Rebel Gaming Club Worst Pickup Episode 49! 49! 49. 49. Chop his ass, wake him up. Nah. That was a weak ass chop. Guys, we got a special episode this week. Why? Because we have a car key crate right here. We've waited two months for this thing. The wizard has come through. The Grand Wizards brought it. This is the silver edition. And yes, Ayash is going to tell you a little bit more about this box here in a second. Yo, how the fuck did we get Sean Long on this bitch? Sean Long is all about the money. It's RGT85 to Hollywood. all you guys out there, or Hollywood. You just got to send him money, and he'll do anything. He was a good friend. Ryan, you sent him the money, correct? I did send the check out. He got it. We got no money in our account. Still counts. That shit's gonna bounce. That's alright, it's like 20 bucks. There ain't no money in the account to bounce, so it's fine. And that's all you sent him? Well, no. I sent him some real currency. It's Confederate. Sorry, you ticker? sent You sent our great-great-grandfather's Confederate currency. Yeah, why wouldn't we? How the fuck is he gonna spend that? You could sell it online. I'm sure it's worth money. It's not worth, like, real money, but, like... Sean Long, I'm so sorry, man. We'll try to get you some real... You know what? I think you deserve it. I'll talk to my boy, Yesse. You'll get to pick one of these games out of here. Oh, my Yes, God. yes. More than I'm getting. I don't even want to speculate what's in this box just yet, guys. Let's open it. No, 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 no. We don't even know the story of this box. Yesse Asha right now is going to tell us the story of the Karki Crate. It was May 10th, 2017. I saw a post on Facebook advertising something called a Karki Crate. I was intrigued. I immediately gave money to Joshua, brother of the wizard, and had a crate sent to my club brethren, Daniel. Cut to May 29th, 2017. Still no crate. I was becoming concerned I'd been bamboozled. I contacted Josh and he assured me the wizard brothers were brewing their magic and would have the crate sent out shortly. The date is June 30th, 2017. At this point, I realized my ignorance. In anger, I did something that only desperate men do. I made a Facebook rant post. I blasted the wizard for deceiving me. I admit it. I removed the rant after the comments got to 100 and asked myself, Why wizard? Why?
So guys, you know the history of this box now. That's Dude, this car key crate. That's a swell box, man. Well, we're not opening it right now. What? We, we got other pickups to do first. I'll hold on to it. Just joint key, hold on to that yeah, for I safekeeping. I got this one. Guys, for 20 bucks, I, uh, I found a deal on Craigslist. She uh, she wanted to meet off the highway, and that's what we did. Whoa. So we got a bunch of really, really mediocre PS1 titles and one heavy hitter. Wait, for 20 bucks. What are you expecting? We got Need for Speed. It's the Porsche one, but she's a little scratched. Yeah. Cool Borders 3, she's fucking scratched. Uh, that sucks. Motocross Mania, which I'm kind of excited about. Never yeah, heard of that. I played that. It's fucking awful. How dare you say that? Need for Speed 2. That's good. We got Tomb Raider 2. That's yeah. good. I mean, good darn when we came out. Arcade yeah. Greatest Hits. Look at that ass. Look at that ass. Look at that ass. Real Fishing, which... This has got to be the most produced game of all time on the PS1. I know, it ties back to the, the fishing episode. What's up, Marcus? What's up, Marcus? Pro Pinball. Uh, CM Retro, you ain't got that one. Uh -huh. We got this Crash Bandicoot game. Scratch to hell. Wow. Dragon Ball Z, Jordan tells me this is the worst one. Yep. And the real reason I wanted this lot, there's some Xbox games too, guys. I'm going to show you that too. But we got the Grand Theft Auto Ooh. Collector's Edition. You got one and two. Yep, one and two. Plus it has the, plus it has the mission pack, the London 1969. Super fun. That's pretty cool, right? That's yeah. sweet. So That's really for 20 cool. bucks, I figured this lot was worth it on that alone. That alone. And then we got like Soldier of Fortune 2. That's an exclusive, guys. Oh, That's Xbox. Whoa. We got Indiana Jones. Oh, that's probably terrible. That's probably terrible. Yeah. We got The Suffering. Oh, that's pretty fun. That's a fun yeah. game. All these are doubles. 2K5. Uh, we got Batman Begins. Garbage. Yeah. Yeah, these garbage. Are, these are all doubles. Quidditch. That was fun. Fable. Fable's Fable. great. Yeah. We got uh, Bulletproof. 50 Cent Game, which I didn't have. Hold on. Give Rich a die train. Hold on. Name all G Unit. Go. I don't know any G Unit. Jordan. 50 name. Cent, Lloyd Banks, uh, Tony Yayo. You know the last one we talked about. I know, I can't fucking remember him though. Young Buck. Young Buck. Because he had an awful song. We got Star Wars Episode 3. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It was fun. Cool. The one time you played. And the last game of the lot is Land of the Dead, guys. This one's too close to home. George A. Romero just passed away. Rest in peace. So I'm glad to get this. It's about a $20 title, guys. You don't oh. see it every day. And uh, yeah, now I got it. So for 20 bucks for all those, good deal. Okay. All right, let's get it. No, 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 no. Come on, guys. Let me get in there. No, you're you're not getting in there yet. Get get out of that box. I want in that box. I asked some of our friends, our YouTube friends out there. Our buddies. Yeah, our buddies. I asked them what they thought was in the box. Well, I think it's full of PS4 exclusive roaches, dollar fidget spinners, a half empty bottle of orange Powerade, and whatever is left of his hopes and dreams, as well as just shame, if he has any left. All right, Crazy Joe here. And the question is, what's in the Kosharski box? Well, my educated guess is going to be uh, let's see, Madden 97 disc only. We got a copy of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Not because it's a good game, because he's probably got 700 of them, and it's worth less than a buck. I'm going to go with a copy of Silent Service Nintendo Entertainment System. Really worn label, and it's going to have two paper clips and a jelly bean inside. And let's see what else. Roaches. So you're probably wondering what is in the Karki crate that you're going to be getting. Well, I can give you a hint on that. I think I have the the know of what's actually going to be inside that box because I uh, recently got a box from him as well, and I just want to show you the the contents of this said uh, Karki crate. Uh, well, <laughs> we got some dish gloves that are dirty. Uh, we got, ooh, a, uh, a Nintendo Mario coin toy. Great. Don't have enough of those. We got a, uh, a broken, no battery 
Game Boy printer. Oh well. Uh, we got a bootleg Yu-Gi-Oh toy or a, a, a fashion doll pen. Okay, and oh, one sock. What it is, Rebel Gamers. So earlier, these crazy sons of bitches come pounding on the wall asking me if I wanted to speculate what's going to be in the Karki crate. I figure, what the hell, I enjoy good speculation, especially if I'm allowed to speculate wild. So people are pretty much going to think of the obvious choices, you know, video games, maybe some crappy video games, maybe some choice video games, I don't know exactly how this shit's supposed to work, uh, but I, you know, I want to get a little more adventurous with this. Like, maybe we find a piece, a lost piece of the Dead Sea Scrolls, and we have to go on some biblical, historical, Indiana Jones-style adventure quest. That'd be pretty awesome. Or, you know, maybe it's just some ancient evil force comes exploding out of the motherfucker, melts our face off. It really is hard to say. I, for one, am very curious, but we should bear in mind that whatever we release from this box might not be so easily returned. I think our friends might be on to something here. I don't know. They might have convinced me. What do you guys think is in the box? John, what do you think? Uh, freak style for PS2. Shitty dirt bike game. I mean, everyone can't be wrong. There's got to be roaches in there. Right? I mean, I have seen roaches in their store, so it's possible there could be some roaches. It's a possibility. There's going to be a Madden in there. Madden. I don't know what year. It's gonna you got to be... guess the year, because everyone's saying Madden. I, I, I've said Madden. 03. Our buddy Joe... Crazy Joe just said Madden. Oh. Two. I was about to say, you know, oh four would have been a good one to have. Yeah. Oh two. Do you want anything else? No. Hold on one second. <laughs> what the fuck? Why'd you spray so much? You just fucking spraying raid down here? You go take a shit and I come back and you guys are spraying raid. Did you want to get stunned by wasps, sir? Those I thought I thought there were roaches, no wasps. You never fucking know. Float is crazy. Mm. You think he shipped wasps? I know I would ship wasps. <laughs> would, say that again? I would ship wasps. <laughs> well, let's hope there's no wasps <laughs> in there. You love wasps. That's, is we got more shit. Yeah, the second pickup this past week, guys, was a GameCube lot. Damn. For a hundred bones, for a hundred bones. You're the GameCube guy. That's I am the GameCube guy now. That's me. We got a purple GameCube. Two okay. memory cards. Two memory cards. We got two controllers, and that includes a spice orange. Ooh. Even has its rubber on it. I see these spice orange. It never has the fucking rubber on it. Rubber. Jordan always has his rubbers on. Always. I don't trust a bitch. We got some games. Damn, that's some good games. We got M Mario Golf. How much you spend on this? $100. 100 bills. We got bills. Super Monkey Ball 2. Shit. Nah, that's pretty fun. We got Ty, the original. Wow. Yeah, I don't even know about that. Mario Party 4. <coughs> Love that. We like that. That's what we like. You fucking hate playing with me. We have Pac-Man World 2. We got Mario Kart Double Dash with the bonus disc. Fuck that game. We got Super Mario Sunshine. I'm very good at that. We got Kirby Air Ride. Hold on, hold on. Throw out a challenge. Got the Meta Knight. You you haven't let people know. Oh, I'm probably the greatest Double Dash player in the world. He's pretty fucking good. I'm pretty good. Maybe one day. If you guys want to challenge me, we're rolling by your town. I'll stop by and kick your ass. Jesus. Was that good? That was good. That was intimidating. Yep, thank you. And the last game of this lot was Pikmin. Pikmin! Pikmin. They're making a new one, aren't they? Yeah. On uh, the 3DS, but it looks like a turd sandwich. But Pikmin 4 is actually coming to the Switch, so. What? So 100 bucks, not so bad. Not so bad. That's exciting. That's pretty fucking good, bro. Any of you guys need any of those titles, hit me up, because those are pretty much all for trade. Those are all doubles. Maybe even triple. Are you fucking kidding me? You could have had a $1,000 scratch-off ticket in that box, but instead we're talking about a $100 GameCube lot. 
Are, are we fucking serious right now? There's money to be made, folks. There's money to be made. What's in the box? What the fuck is in that shit box? What's in the box? It's go time. No, 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 not yet. Are you fucking kidding me? We got a trade. It From better the, be fucking. It's awesome. Woodbarian. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah, Woodbarian, he's listening. our guy, he's our guy. I'm listening. He posted his video last night saying, uh, you know, we did a trade and we did do a trade. And he was saying he wished he had a crew like ours. We're well, pretty cool. We'll come to Tennessee. Wood, you can be on our crew. All you gotta do is get a denim jacket. You get some denim? That's it. That's pretty much only requisite to being in the crew. Prerequisite. So we got a package here from him, and it says, Dano, love the show and all the guys. Thanks to all of you for helping my channel grow. WB. WB. His channel is growing too. Hold on. He's about to hit Hold 150 on. subs. Time out. Put it on the package. <laughs> well, it was in a package. Oh, I pulled okay. this out. This is a package okay. in a package. I was like, everyone's reading our note right now. No, 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 no. I sent him. Oh, oh, that's hot. That is hot. This is a game I've been wanting for a while. That's I, spicy. It was on his last pickup, and I said, you're lucky to find that, because I've been looking for it for a while. He said, Dano, hit me up. We'll work something out. And we did. I sent him. I sent him. uh Some stuff. You go check out Woodbury's channel. You want to know what we sent him? Yeah, you. I'll link. We, I'll link the video down below, guys. Make sure to sub to to Woodbury. He's, he's a great guy. He's a great he's guy. Funny. And he's a sweetheart, and he's very funny. So he sent me this. Chili con carnage. Oh shit, Holmes. On the PSP. Damn. You don't see this every day, guys. This is kind of like a uh, is this Mexican Grand Theft Auto. Pretty much, that's that's what it boils down to. A little more over the top. You're blowing everything up. Uh, a lot that's of go find. Lots of gunplay. Oh. <laughs> Got him. Woodbarian, thank you so much, guys. Make sure to check out his channel because I think you would enjoy it. He's about to hit 150 subs. Let's make that let's, happen. Let's get him to at least 170. Come on. Yeah. Got me all fucking amped up. Get the fucking package! Break out the stool. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Got to drop an elbow on this mother. Okay. We... Guys, in honor of this great, great episode. Get the knife out. Get the knife. So we have the car key crate ready to go. But before we do that, we thought we'd have a little contest. We got our... Rebel Gaming Club t-shirts that we are still selling. Ah, that's so dope. It is dope. Got that gold. And we're giving one away free. Why? Because in honor of the car key crate, of course. You let us know in the descriptions down below, in the comments, what your favorite item in this crate was, and you'll be entered. And why? And you'll be entered. Well, I guess you could say why, too. Yeah. You could be entered for this shirt right here. Size large and XL only. So, so let's hope you're a, a bigger you, you dude. You got some meat on you. Hopefully you're beefy. You got some fucking guns. 
Let's open it up. Let's open it up, guys. It's a dull knife, you pussy. Hold on. Should we all pray on this? I mean, I've been praying for, about, for days. I'm about to fucking stab it. Just let me open it. No, don't stab it. Don't stab it. Just get get it in there. Pray that some bitch out. The whole Karki crate has everyone talking, everyone speculating of what's in the box, what could be coming in the box. Rumor has it that there was only one Karki crate created and only one Karki crate sold and that it took weeks and weeks of waiting and waiting for it to come in, but the day has finally come. Everyone all across YouTube has been guessing what's in the Karki crate, what's in the Karki crate, what's in the Karki crate. Well, I'm gonna tell you what I think is in the Karki crate. Probably some roaches and some really Really shitty video games. Um, I, I mean, have you seen a store? I, I don't know, but let's find out what's in the car key crate. This is how I cut. Oh man, don't look, cause you can see a game right away. Shh. Oh my God. Don't look, John. Make sure we're getting all this good stuff right here. I'm following it. I'll do it with my eyes closed. Let me help you, let me help you. Don't crack the box, cause this is, oh. oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop looking. This is too good. Oh, <laughs> shit. There we go, boys. Oh, this is. Oh, 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 oh. What is whoa, whoa. Oh, hold, hold it down. Hold it. No, 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 no. Oh. We can't. Oh, okay. First up, guys, we have an autographed scratch ticket. It looks like a loser. It could have been $1,000, but it is not. It is a loser, in fact. But we have Josh. We have Mama K and Laurel. Oh, and Aaron's right there too. And the Perler Man. The Grand Wizard's on there? Uh, I hit up Yese about getting this box. We were originally gonna split it and he was like, no, I just wanna buy it. I wanna buy it for you. And he's like, the only thing I want out of it is the autograph scratch ticket if it comes with one. So okay, Yese, yeah. here it is, but I'll set this to the side and, and send it along with that package I got coming your way. I wanna say this one. We got Aladdin! Oh! 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 Shit! I fucking love this movie! Aw oh, man, it's janky. It's no, it's a. It's, well. Okay, it's, it's fine. I thought there might have been some money in it. There ain't no roaches in there. That was good. That was right. Well, you know what, guys? The. I mean, if I had some VHSs, this would be cool, but I, I don't really. I don't really collect VHS much, so. Yeah, he, he doesn't at all. I like movie, she like movie, he like movie, VHS. Oh! Vintage. Oh my god. From Ninja Turtles 3? This is the April O'Neil doll? That's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, it's that ain't lantern. bad. I had some of these. I had I had the Samurai Mike, and I had the Samurai Wrath. Dude, this is the shitty movie. This is That's good. a really bad one. But this is good novelty right here. That's good. You go right on the wall there. I watched it a lot too. Oh shit, cut that out and clip and collect. Oh no, you gotta leave it in the box. You cut that, it's probably gonna devalue it down to oh about a dollar fifty. There's like no gain. Whoa, 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 what's, ne what's next? Oh, we got a Skylanders Giants. I don't fucking know what that is. That's fucking bullshit no is what that is. Nobody fucking plays with Skylanders. Here, here's something I don't know. Oh, oh. That's what? A, that's a Dorbs. This is a Dorbs? Turn around. What is it? What's the name on it? Nebula. That's Nebula. Who fuck is Nebula? I don't know what this that's is. That's Guardian of the Galaxy. I know that, but I don't... i never seen it. Wow. Alright. Yes, I'm sending that your way too, bud. Hey, okay, we got a shirt. Oh shit! What's on it? Holy shit! That's a In big Karki, shirt. We trust. See, that's good right there. What? What size is that? That's a three X. That's a good fucking shirt. We got a three X shirt. Joe, put that on. I can put that on. Put that shit. That last three things. Oh my god, three things left, guys. They we got still, silver. We still haven't found any cockroaches. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh shit, we each get one. You look dope. Thank you. Yeah, this is a cool shirt. Yo, oh. tie, tie it like a fucking. I won't be able to keep it, but it's a cool shirt. Why can't you? Oh, okay. Then I can. Tie me in the background. I ain't tying it. I think Yesay would want you to have that shirt. Thanks, Yesay. Oh. Oh my god! 
a video game wizard. We got a video DVD. game wizard DVD right here, guys. Hold Sign. on, hold on. It's signed. It even has Jabroni. Oh. Crazy K. Are you kidding Laurel. me? Laurel. We got Laurel. Look at that bootleg DVD. <laughs> oh, that's good. Uh, this is incredible. Yeah. And he used an old PS2 case right here. Can I read the bag? Yeah. Stuff on this DVD includes the entire Miami trip with bonus never before seen footage. And as an added bonus, I even threw in the Miami Pawn Shop trip. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the movie. Remember, woo! Woo! Hey, don't open that. Okay. Oh, there it is. I yes. think I know what that is, and I'm excited. This is this is really the item that I really this wanted. This tape is weird. We don't have this tape. I anymore. thought there was games in here. I guess the Karki Crate. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh shit. Oh, that's gonna be good, isn't it? Guys, I went down to visit Aaron and spent the day with him, and I forgot to purchase one of these. If you guys didn't know, I did his outro theme song. The video game wizard. That's me. So, I know Aaron a little bit. And now I have some of his music. Man, he's looks handsome. He does look handsome. Uh, I'm trying to find the... Be true to yourself. That is the big hit, number eight. Be true to yourself. That's, that's probably the, the best one. And it has the, the, the game wizard theme song, which I think is his... I think that's his opening rap song. Yeah. I gotta trim the sleeves. They're too long. Oh, you look good. And it has Do the Daffy. Wow, this is awesome. He didn't autograph it though. Oh my god. Do dual disc. Wait, this is a dual disc, guys. Holy the shit. The beginning, 10 year anniversary, and the young Karki mixtape. Damn. Man. Wait, he didn't hold on, he didn't fill that second one. What how do you know? No, it's pretty full. Oh, that's that's cool. pretty full. That's pretty, that's a good mixtape right there. What's that? It's the last thing in the box. The last thing. Do you have an idea what it is? I have no idea. Is it going to be a video game? No. Why would the video game wizard send video games? It is. <laughs> oh, shit. It's the last item is a video game. Is it Shrek? It is a video game. It might be a game that might be in that stack. Shut the fuck. Yep. Yep. If it's the one I think it is that I just mentioned. All right, guys, which game is it? You pick. You both get to pick what game's in there. I'm saying it's real fishing because I see this fucking game everywhere. Jordan, what do you think it is? Mm. Motocross Mania. All right, guys, are you ready? Yep, here we go. It's Dragon Ball Z. Ah. Oh! I got him. You gotta be kidding me. What are the chances? Sure, pull it out. We didn't open this. Whoa, his is minty though, so that's good. Oh, this is the real deal. This is the greatest hits. It's all scratched. Holy shit. Actually, that's not as bad as I thought it was. Well, what are the chances, guys? We got guys? two copies of some shitty games. <laughs> well, in honor of that, guys, along with the t-shirt, I'm sending this scratched up copy that I picked up this week. Ultimate Battle 22. That was it. That, that that was all that was in the crate. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> well, guys. The, that about sums it up. I was hoping it was going to be real fishing. No. What are the odds that's the game you just fucking picked up? Out of all the games... Yeah, what are the chances? Joe, what do you think of this situation? Uh, you got a shirt out of it. Yeah, I know. I'm happy. It was a cool fucking shirt, too. <laughs> it is. It's a good shirt. Oh, man. Uh, that was kind of fun. That was pretty good. How much was that? Yes, Ayasha paid $30. Holy shit. So think about it. Well, the shirt was... I paid $20 for my 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 car key shirt. So that's $20 that's right 20. there. This is at least 5 bucks right here. So five. we're at $25. How much is, is that? How much is April worth? April's probably worth about 5 bucks like this, I would say. Yeah. Maybe not. Maybe like two bucks. But still, it's close enough. That Dorbs is ten bucks. Dang. Yeah, that was like clearance, like dollar fifty. But this right here is like priceless. So that's priceless. That's true. Guys, we're the Rebel Gaming Club. This has been the worst pickup, episode forty-nine. 
Make sure to comment down below your favorite item in and the car key crate and you enter for that that scratched up uh, PS1 game plus a Rebel shirt. Gaming Club t-shirt. Yeah. Uh, besides I'll set, that. I'll, maybe I'll throw something in too. I'll, I'll throw I, something in too. I got things in my house I need to get rid of. We'll do our own crate, guys. Oh, yeah, let's do a crate. All right, enter. Enter. The Rebel Gaming Club turn crate. Turn into a crate. <laughs> All right. So we'll just pack everything up that he sent us and we'll send it to someone else. Oh, I'm going to send you a t shirt of mine. An old shitty shirt. Yeah, might have some holes in it, but it's a nice shirt. I'll find one of mine, too. Guys, we're still working on this uh, best of the first year. So you guys last week commented a bunch too. Keep throwing on, them in. Yeah, anything you want to see from the first year in the highlight video, please comment. It's been a great first year. Yeah, it's been awesome. Fun. I, I started watching some of the early episodes. We've come a long way. We were fucking funny back then. We've come funny a long something. way. Until next week, guys, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, yes. Subscribe. Share. 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 And then Share. we say, hello. 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 Goodbye. Oh, hey. Call it. Shout out to Mateo. <clears throat> Mash Mateo. Fuck Mateo. What do you mean Rebel Gaming Club sent a check? I'm RGT85 here. I'm wearing sunglasses inside. I have on a gold watch. I'm not the type of person to accept a check as a payment to do this show. I'm not a charity case here, all right? I'm fucking Hollywood. So they did send money to? Confederate currency. Confederate currency. What the fuck am I going to do with Confederate currency in 2017? A check that's probably going to fucking bounce in Confederate currency. Fucking great.